please subscribe and press the bell icon for more content. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to learn how to make calendar design in MS PowerPoint. First of all, open your PowerPoint, you can see here. Then select the all area and press delete. You can see here, delete the area is here. Then go to the design, click on this designs option is here and click the slide size option and click a custom slide size. Then choose the size you can use the any size for the calendar design same i am using the a4 size paper here then click the protect options here and click ok then click a maximize you can see here then our page is ready to design now then go to the insert and click this the save and click a uh, oval shapes here and later we'll zoom out here and draw this oval shapes hold the shape to bottom and draw this shapes Oval shapes and drag it here, maybe like this one is here. You can see here. Then click on this the rectangle shapes here and draw this rectangle shapes, maybe like this. And click on this rectangle shapes and click on maybe like this. You can see here and click a uh, first oval shapes and hold the control button and click this rectangle shapes and this rectangle shapes. You can see here. Then click a format and go to the more shapes this option here then click the soft brackets here you can see here our oval shapes is open here and go to the click on the shapes go to the format and change the color is here first of all make it no outline go to the shape outline and click the no outline here you can see here press ctrl or command D duplicate here this is then change the color maybe like this one color is and drag it here and click the send back what is here maybe like this you can see here this design is little bit ready for now you can see here and little bit right side is here and little bit decrease the size maybe like this you can see here then go to the insert and click the save and choose the oval shapes here and draw the oval shapes maybe like this you can see here and drag it here something like this one is here and drag here maybe like this and press ctrl or command a duplicate here and drag it here and little bit increase the height here maybe like this here something like this you can see here then click on this shapes go to the format and click the shape outline make it no outline here and click on this shapes and go to the shape outline no outline it's here and click on this oval shapes and go to the format and click on this shape fill and click on this pictures and you can to fill the pictures whatever you want and i go to the desktop i have already downloaded this pictures is here then i am choose this student pictures is here then click on you can see here then click on this the format and go to the crop option is here and later with this dot you can see here this dot is option here and little bit down it here this the page is in bit high here then little bit up it here maybe like this and little bit right side is also increase here and drag it a little bit here you can see here maybe like this then drag it here a little bit and this also drag it here something I took it the height maybe like this here something like this you can see here click on this here and the right side is here left side is here click on the shapes and go to the format and go to the shape fill and click on this pictures and again choose the any pictures you can use this here simple i choose this one pictures is here you can see here then click on this format and go to the crop option is here and this also will increase the left side is here right side is here maybe like this leave it down it here something like this you can see here and later yes this is perfect now here you can see and click on this insert and go to the shape and choose the oval shape and draw this shape something like this you can see here and drag it here and it will increase the height here maybe like this and change the color something i choose this one color is here and make it no outline here and send to back what is here maybe like this you can see here a little off here and down it here something like this you can see just like this and this also click on this saves and go to the format and click on this save fill and choose the pictures 
and choose this one pictures is here something like this you can see here and go to the format and click on this crop and later we increase the height here something like this pictures maybe like this you can see yes you can see here then click on the shapes and press ctrl command and duplicate here and press shift control button and down it here like this then we increase the height here and go to the format and click on this send backward here something like this you can see here our little bit design is ready for now then click on this answer click on this shape and click on this rectangle shapes here and draw this rectangle shape something like this you can see here a little down it here increase the height here something like this and change the color maybe like this you can see here and make no outline here something like this and click on this insert and go to the table option is here and draw the table you can use i'm using seven is the here and down it seven you can see here one two three four five six and go to the layout and insert tab of is there would here something like this and drag this the down here maybe like this increase the height something like this you can see here and right side is the little side here you can see here just like this and select the table all you can see here i select the table all here go to the layout sorry design and click on this the shape fill color make it white color there's no fill also here you can see here and choose the outline maybe like this outline and outline where it is 3 pd you can see here and click on this draw table and click on this the border and click on this all border here you can see here just like this and little bit increase the decrease the height this one rows here then and type your select the text all and go to the home and change the color is maybe like black color here and type your monday and tab tuesday tab wednesday tab thursday tab friday tab saturday and click on this select on this the column and go to the layout and in, insert right here and type in sunday you can see here and select the all table and go to the layout and click on this the sorry click on this home and click on the center alignment here and go to the layout and click on this center alignment here something like this you can see here like this center alignment here you can see just and type your days here 0 1 tab 0 2 tab 0 3 tab 0 4 tab 0 5 tab you can see here 31 you can see here complete i type to complete this text here and select this sorry select this row saturday only and go to the design and change the setting color is maybe like this black color and select the this row and go to the home and change the color maybe i change this white color and select this two row here and go to the design and select the color maybe i choose this one color is like better then select this text and home change the color it's white color it's here maybe like this and select the all table and go to the design and click on this the pen outline color is white color is here you can see here and click on this the border and click on this all border you can see here our this table is style is here you can see here like this and go to the insert and click on this shape and click on this shapes here rectangle shapes here and draw these shapes something like this and little bit right side left side is here you can see then click on this the shape fill color is black color make it no outlines here and choose the outline 
sorry choose the line shapes and draw this line shapes something like this hold the shape button and drag it here and little bit left side is here something like this and since the outline color also black color and outline weight is the little bit increase the weight here something like this you can see then click on this outline little bit up here hold the shift button and up here little bit down it here maybe like this you can see just and click on this shapes a little bit decrease the height here something like this you can see here then click on this shapes and right click here and add it text and type jar one and select it and bold it here a little bit increase the height maybe like this and this text all the select that is table text here maybe like this and increase the height here font size here and click on this bold here and you can see here just like this you can see and click on this insert and click on this word here just click on this the home and click on this word style set text box style also here and click on this text type to enter zero enter to enter zero enter here and select all this text and click on this bold and increase the height here maybe like this and drag it here maybe like this you can see just like it here and select this text and increase the height here maybe like this you can see here just drag it here and like this put it here something like this you can see here little bit our calendar design is ready for now then type here is the, your company name and company address here just i make the name here simple i go to the text box and draw this text box here and select on this text this text and click on this bold here alignment here and select all the text and little bit increase the height decrease the height here maybe like this and this is the right large menu it's here and drag it here maybe like this you can see here just like this drag it here and change the font color you can whatever you want this the color something like just this one color and this also color is here maybe like this you can see here and click on this insert and go to the shape and choose this the line shapes here and draw the shapes you can see here and up it here maybe like this you can see just outline color change this the color is here something like this and go to the this text box and type your month here simple i type january okay you can see here and drag it here maybe like this and select on this text and click on this bold and later it increase the font size here maybe like this you can see here and click on this home and click on this text box and draw this text box here type your website here dot com here you can see i will up here type your email address here press enter email address here something like this and select all central alignment is here something like this you can see just like here and click on this text and go to the format and click on this alignment and click on this also central alignment here you can see here you can see our one page is ready for now calendar design and you can more page in create also here then press this slide here and right click here and click on this the duplicate slide you can see just make it one this duplicate and press again controller d you can see here this text sorry this page is here and click on this page and simple change this the text only then type your february for example and type your month is here to here and this also same here and change this text here maybe like this and this also here the february march here simple you can see and change this the two and two month here you can see and easily change this text here something like this you can see here i hope you are understand this video please like comment share subscribe my channel thank you for watching this video thank you so much